Here we are, intro to the fight song, that to get at that Cam McKinley marching bulldogs. More than 120 strong. Everyone in sync, including drummer Eli Gold, sophomore, who it seems was born with a gift. But since birth, he has also faced some significant challenges. His heart wasn't beating when he was first born for 21 minutes, they coded him. Um, so he was very, very sick when he was first born, and he was expected to not survive. What do you think happened, Eli? Golden survived, but he is legally deaf and has mild cerebral palsy. In class, he learns with the help of an interpreter, but drumming a beat seems to help. He's literally tuned in. Drumming has, uh, has been something he looks forward to, something he uses as a release, something that makes sense to him. Music engages part of the brain simultaneously that most other activities don't. Band director Zachary Taylor took the chance, including Golden in his marching band, and something amazing happened. He identifies and can feel the lower frequency rhythms. So he can feel maybe in the ground, or just when he's wearing the drum in the harness. What do you feel or hear? I feel the beat. That is such a complex thing to be able to do. You know, that is not just going to your room and smashing drums for a while. That is social, it's interactive. You're the first deaf drummer. Yeah. There could be a second and a third and a fourth. Yeah. yeah. And when he is marching on Fridays with the band, Eli is as one with all of the others. It's, it's teaching the other students compassion, how to be patient, how to work with others that struggle a little more than they do. So, I mean, it's teaching all of our students life skills that are gonna, are gonna help them tremendously. Great job! In Canton, Ohio, Dave Nethers, News Nation.